has brought you to. Huh? How many of you can feel tonight, glory to God? Let's just feel it for a moment. Let's just take a moment. Let's just count out everything else. And think about what you believe God has called you to do. Can you just take a moment for yourself and begin to just begin to, to discover what's inside of you? Can you just uh, uh, feel? Listen, I, I'm going to go a little farther than that. God may have called you to preach the gospel. God might be calling you to preach. Can you just feel the sermon? You know, I was blessed this morning. A man of God called me and said that God had gave him something and woke him up, couldn't sleep because that's the beginning of the vision. That's the beginning of a ministry. Can you now, if you, if you have the talent to sing, can you think of a new song right now? Can you let a new song be birthed in you right now? Can you just feel the energy of God rolling through you? Can you just feel the fluttering of that baby inside of you? Somebody, you're impregnated. <clears throat> you're impregnated right now with something great. You're impregnated with something that somebody else might have did before. But guess what? They never did it like the way God is going to give it to you to be done. Can you just feel it on the inside of you? You know, as I sit here in the studio, you know, this was one point was really just a dream. Amen. Never thought it would come to fruition. Amen. As we're preparing now for the talk show Tea Time with Shirley. Now I can feel the fluttering of the baby. Now a little bit more. I can feel the baby kicking. Amen. Before it was a flutter. Because why? It was in this early, early trimester. Who was watching me today with a dream? Who's watching me today with hope? Amen. Who is watching me today? And you know what I'm shouting out that the Lord has called you, gifted you, and talented you with something, glory to God, that will change the face of our world. Or the face of somebody else's world. How many of you know somebody is believing in you? Somebody's believing. They're watching you. I keep, I don't know why it keeps coming back to me to tell you that people are watching you. And they don't have the, they, they don't have the strength to go forth to believe in what has been put inside of them. But when they see you, you give them hope. You make them know that I can do this. I can do this. I don't have to just dream, but it can come to reality. 